Ah, oh, hi everybody. I'm fucking back. Two nights in a fucking row, man. I know you're going, what the fuck is this clown's problem, man? Well, I'll tell you what my fucking problem is. I'm going to fucking rant. <laughs> but first, I got to throw a finger. Yeah, I got to throw the finger. Oh my God. But uh, secondly, I got to have a fucking drink of my, uh, my uh, Seacrum's uh, pussy ass fucking wine cooler. <laughs> Oh my God, this stuff is so good, man. I'm starting to get buzzed after like two gulps. <laughs> Woo, let's calm down. I got a long ways to go on this fucking video, man. I better get up and do some fucking dancing, man. I got my new hat on. I got my new hair looking good. I got my studio looking good. Fuck, man, I got my music in the background fucking playing. Or that way, really. <laughs> oh, fuck, man. Holy shit. Oh, Christ. What the fuck? Well, about one o'clock this afternoon. Oh, I gotta calm myself. I'm out of breath here. <coughs> okay, that's better. <laughs> anyway, let's get serious. I got a knock on my door around one o'clock this afternoon. And uh, I refuse to answer it because I never answer my fucking doors. It's always fucking, uh, I think it's a fucking devil or something, man. It was fucking creepy, man. They knocked for about five minutes. And then I fucking, uh, they, I heard them leave by the front door. And uh, so I opened my fucking apartment door. And I had this fucking letter taped to my fucking, I don't know if you can fucking see that, man. I had this fucking letter taped to my fucking door, man. Oh, my God. I think I know what it is. It's from St. Uh, Peter's Mental Health Facility in the state of Minnesota. I'm pretty sure this is my new, my new court, court order. Oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> I blacked everything out so you don't know what the fuck's going on here, man. Holy shit. I'm kind of scared to open this because I think they're going to recommit me, man. Either that or it's a fucking court date or something. I don't fucking know, man. I don't, I don't fucking know, man. Jesus Christ. I got to get up and do some fucking dancing, man. I got to fucking just, just relax. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh my god. Penny's getting too old for that kind of shit, man. Fuck, I'm about seven years old. Oh, okay, let's uh I'm gonna do a movie review. <laughs> I'm gonna do a movie review for you tonight. One of my favorite movies of all time. <coughs> oh, that stuff makes you burp, man. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> oh my god. Where's my finger? Oh, Holy shit. Okay, let's calm down. Let's get my composure back. <laughs> ah, fuck it. <laughs> yeah, you all think I'm happy, but I'm not really fucking happy, man. Holy shit. I'm just fucking drunk. Holy shit. I think this is the end of Penny right here, man. I think they're going to set me back, uh, send me back for another uh, five years or something like that. I'm not really exactly sure, but I'm um, sure it's probably going to happen. And I, I don't know what the fuck to do. And I think I'm just going to fucking go back, get the fuck away from all my fucking detractors in this fucking crazy hell state that I live in. Gotta like my hat. My hat's so cool. <laughs> Just stay right there. Oh my god. Oh Jesus Christ. Alright, there we go. Now I feel a little bit better. This is all the people that want to send me back to uh St. Peter Mental Health Facility. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, and fuck you. Oh my so fuck <laughs> And a big fuck you to who's ever issued the order. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh, you better relax. I'm sweating like a pig, man. Holy shit. Oh, 
This stuff gets me fucking ranted, man. Woo! Ah, that's much better. Holy shit! Oh, I'm already fucking drunk! <laughs> Can you hear that fucking music in front of me? Oh, I don't know. Anyway, uh... I'll, I'm gonna open this up probably in a couple of days. I'm too scared to open it up right now, so... You know, I don't know how in the fuck that asshole got into our building. We have a security door on our front and back doors. So I have no fucking idea how we get in, man. No fucking idea. Oh, Christ. Oh, my God. They got a fucking... My glasses are fogging up. They're about ready to cry. I don't know why. Because anything's better in this fucking... Fucking city. <laughs> I'd be happy to go back. <laughs> All right. We'll talk about that later in my next podcast. Not right now. I just got to uh, think about opening it up and just uh, uh, contemplate about uh, my uh, uh, recommitment and uh, things like that. And uh, we're going to talk about it. Fuck, fuck that shit. Fuck that shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, time for a movie review. Ooh, this came out about like 12, 15 years ago. Everybody see this movie? Bubba Hotep? That is really one cool fucking movie, man. Oh my god. <laughs> Bubba Hotep. You know, it stars Bruce Campbell, one of my favorite actors. At least in my mind, he's one of my favorite actors. I don't really know, but uh, he plays... Uh, he plays like he's 80 years old, and he thinks he's Elvis Presley. And he lives in this fucking nursing home with a bunch of other loony bins. And they all think they're like that's presidents, and they're like fucking uh, senators, and, you know, and famous actresses, and actors, and stuff. There's one guy who thinks he's fucking the Lone Ranger, man. <laughs> oh, my God. This fuck home, man. They make me look normal. <laughs> Ooh, okay, let's slow it down a little bit. Just slow it down. Ooh, I'm eight minutes into this video and I haven't uh, said fucking Jack shit. That's okay because Jack is full of shit. <laughs> anyway, uh, ooh, 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 we better slow down, man. I'm fucking, uh, I feel like I'm dusted. Well, anyway, the movie's really about this nursing home for, like, 89-year-old people who are just fucking completely crazier than Penny the Lonely Clown. And uh, they're being plagued by this fucking mummy. <laughs> Apparently, a few weeks earlier, a train that was going by the nursing home, they, they're right next to a fucking river, the nursing home, right? And this fucking train derailed, and it had the Egyptian... Uh, mummy on it, like uh, one of those traveling Egyptian shows, and it fucking derailed and went into the river, and apparently the mummy escaped from a sarcophagus. <laughs> I'm already drunk, man. I can't even, I can't even pronounce words, man. Just bear with me. Bear with me. Anyway, so the mummy, in order to live forever, he starts preying on the people in the fucking nursing home. He has to suck their fucking souls out of their butt ass. <laughs> I'm not joking, man. It's fucking weird. It's fucking creepy, man. He, he's dressed like a fucking cowboy. He's like 4,000 years old. Egyptian mummy. And basically... <laughs> it's so stupid. But it's a great movie, man. It fucking works. It fucking works. It's done by Sam Raimi. We all know who Sam Raimi is. Oh, my God. Bruce Campbell thinks he's Elvis Presley. <laughs> Ozzy Davis thinks he's Lyndon B. Johnson or one of those ex-presidents. <laughs> anyway, this fucking this fucking zombie fucking uh, mummy has to he, he roams the hallways in this fucking nursing home every night, right? I'm not fucking kidding you, man. He's dressed like a fucking cowboy. I don't get it, man. I just don't fucking get it. He has like a holster, a hat. <laughs> Like, like uh, you know, the fucking cowboy shit on, man. 
and he fucking tries to prey on people who are fucking, you know, sleeping in their bed, or they're in the bathroom taking a shit or a piss, and, uh, he gets them on the ground, and he fucking starts sucking their souls out of their fucking bodies, so he gets more life, because he wants to live forever, it's fucking creepy, man, he has to actually suck, suck their fucking, uh, souls out of their fucking butt ass. <laughs> I'm not joking, man. It's fucking creepy, man. He has to put his fucking lips up against their fucking butt ass and suck their souls right out. Oh my god, it's fucking creepy. I don't know whoever thought about that is fucking demented, man. I kind of like it, though. <laughs> oh, slow it down, man. Slow it down. Anyway, I think it came out about 15 years ago. Or 12 years ago or something like that. Bruce Camp, the whole cast is really good. The nurses, Reggie Bannister is in it, a whole bunch of famous people. And uh, the nursing home is kind of a dumpy little fucking nursing home. You won't want to fucking retire there, man. <laughs> you have your fucking soul sucked out of your fucking asshole, man. Anyway, I won't tell you too much about it, but uh, it's a pretty cool fucking movie. I don't fucking find it's kind of slow, it has really cool music, and it's kind of fucking just thought provoking. Thought provoking, folks. Just thought provoking. <laughs> I think you might like this movie though. Check it out, man. It's well worth checking out. I love it, man. Oh, they killed the mummy at the end, man. They killed the mummy at the end. I don't know. That fucking mummy is really creepy, man. Holy shit. Oh, I gotta move one of my hooks. Hang on, man. I'm doing something really important, man. Really important. Here. God. I gotta move one of my vials, man. I gotta move one. Right there. We gotta move it over here. Yeah, there we go. Gotta move this one. Gotta move this one. There we go. There we go. Holy shit. Whew, here, take another drink of my fucking, uh, elixir of life. <laughs> Whew. I better slow down. Penny's gonna have a fucking heart attack, man. minutes and I haven't said a fucking thing yet but uh well that's my videos my podcast they they're they have no content or nothing I just kind of fucking wing it along man wing it along <laughs> oh my god oh I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing man I'm already I drank about three quarters of this shit and I'm already drunk man Like I said, man, the devil came knocking at my fucking door today. And man, I tell you, man, I was scared shitless. I was dropping clown tacks in my fucking underwear today, man. Oh, I knew who it was, man. It was a fucking devil, man. It was a fucking devil. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't even know if I can sleep tonight. I think he's going to come back and knock on my door again. Jesus fucking Christ, man. I just don't fucking get it. I just don't fucking get it. What the fuck did I ever do to anybody, man? Except make, make, make people fucking laugh. That's about all you do, man. <laughs> uh. <coughs> Excuse me.
here, what should I talk about besides my dismal fucking day? <laughs> oh, hey, you want to see a cool bottom trip? Check this out, man. Oh, God. Oh, I like building model kits, man. They are the fucking best. Oh my god. Whew. Well, I'm fucking spent, man. I'm fucking spent. Holy shit. Whew. I just thought I'd tell you about this fucking letter I got today, man. So, it's really about this and the movie review of uh, Bubba Hotel. So, you know, uh, I know you're all fucking praying for me to go to fucking hell. And I'm probably halfway there by now. So, you know, I guess, uh, I guess you're gonna get your wish. Pretty soon I'll be burning the burning down in hell. You guys will be laughing your fucking ass off. Uh, but I'm coming back for you when I turn into a fucking zombie. He's gonna send me back. The devil's gonna send me back, man. <laughs> I'm serious, man. I'm coming for you. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Isn't that cool? That is fucking cool. Holy shit. I think this is some kind of, uh, I don't know, mummy rejuvenator. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, pretty cool music, huh? It's kind of like ambient type music, electronic shit. Can we, oh, hey, hey, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Finally got Ronald to fucking say hello. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> oh, my God. Here we go. Oh, I'm running out of fucking things to say, folks. I'm fucking ready to pass out, man. Penny's fucking getting old, man. Penny is gonna fucking die pretty soon. I can feel it. Everything, my brain is so full of fog, I don't even know what the fuck's going on anymore, man. I've been out of the joint for five months now from the uh, St. Peter Mental Health Facility, and fuck, man, I can't even figure out what fucking day of the week it is, man. It's fucking sad. Fuck, I don't even know how I'm doing these uh, podcasts, man. The fuck? I can't. I think it's just on, uh, just sheer instinct or something, man. It's fucking weird. Oh my god. I got, I got, oh my god. Oh, I'm sweating really bad here. Oh, I gotta wipe off. Sorry, folks, I'm sweating like a pig, man. Holy shit. <laughs> oh god, that feels better. Perspiration is just running down my face, man. Right into my fucking mouth. Oh, that's cool. Anyway, I'm gonna get going pretty soon. I already ate and eight, 18 minutes and 50 seconds, so I haven't got anything else to say, but I'll try to come back in a few days and do another podcast for you and give you an update on that fucking letter if I ever get the guts to open it. So, uh, if it fucking bugging me, man, if it bugging me on the phone and everything, I just block everybody. So I'm going to get going. I'm going to cry myself to sleep. Or bring myself to sleep. And uh, we'll talk to you at another time in another podcast. So you all take care. And remember, fuck you all. I love you. <laughs>